Blackbirds. Let's see here. We got a box from windowcleaner.com. See what we got here. See what we got here. Wonder if it's ordered a few things, so we'll see what we'll see what's what here. Great for starting your charcoal. Oh yeah, that's right. So, liquidator 3.0 channel, Mormon uh, Fugu washer, um, the Dr. Turdenstein, Dr. Angle, I mean, somebody's like, hey man, can you review the Dr. Angle? Sure. It's thick and it's black. Um, yeah, 14 inch 2.0. Is this a yeah, 2.0 channel? 14 inch. Mormon T bar. Mormon handle. Made in China? China. 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 Made in China? China. So. Everyone knows. I'm not the biggest fan of Mormon tools. However, I'm going to give them a shot. Shit is fucking trash. Got some Mormon soft rubber in these channels. I'm gonna I'm going all Mormon, man. That's it. That's it, man. Hey. My hunger life is over. No more hunger. Mormon only, dudes. This is gonna turn into the Mormon channel. This is where I only do Mormon tool reviews. Just like that dude that does Sorbo, but just the Mormon, only Mormon stuff. So, we got their new wash, their Fugu washer here, and their Mormon T bar. Not exactly sure what's going on here. Some kind of lock or tightener or something. What's this? I don't know. It doesn't work. And we're going to do all that with some. Some squeeze deluxe. So we're gonna go Mormon window cleaner today. I used to have a I used to have a one of those dry walkers, but I got rid of that. I gave it to somebody. I did not like it. Well first I had to replace the broken part, then I gave it to somebody. You're wondering what this video is going to be about. It's going to be about WCR putting way too much tape on this bottle. That's what it's going to be about. It's going to be about Mormon tools and what I really think about them. Have they improved since my pre-order of the very first liquidator channel? Have they improved? We'll see. Can't. This is a lot of tape. There's a, there's a lot of tape on here. Sorry. Some squeeze deluxe. Some of that. So yeah, man. It's the Mormon vlog. Cue all the cool music.
Yeah, so some of you were probably watching this video and like, this dude doesn't like more. There's some things I like about more. Um, the accelerator handle. I like that. Um, I used to like their washer sleeve, but they changed it and um, kind of went to crap. I've never really been a fan of the channels. I actually pre-ordered the Liquidator channel when it first came out. The Liquidator channel. I bought everything that Mormon had to offer straight out of the gate. Everything. Pre-ordered all of it. The, the handles, the everything. I did everything. This is before the accelerator handle, of course. And uh, what I got is not what I paid for. And I'll do some... What I normally zero degree, I'll use this little 14 here. It's bite, 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 bite. This shit is meant not made for this. It's just not made for this. Oh, maybe somebody's gonna be like, hey man, you know, it's good for residential stuff. Listen, if you buy something like a squeegee, I can use a Sorbo squeegee on a residential job or a commercial job. I can use it on both, but I just can't can't seem to do that with this stuff. So in the time that it usually takes me to do the entirety of the exterior of this restaurant, the entirety of this, the exterior of this restaurant, I did fucking six windows. Shit is fucking trash. You tell me what I'm doing wrong here. That is a Mormon channel in a Mormon handle, and it won't stay. The teeth are still there. Fi they're not filed down. You tell me why in the fuck that won't that won't hold on that channel. And where's the adjustment at? Where's the adjustment on this handle to make that tighter? Where? The fuck out of here the fuck out of here that's why everybody switches your channels out in your handles because the channels that you provide are garbaggio garbaggio there's my review commercial work garbaggio junk well I'm gonna start off by saying that none of the opinions that you hear here are a reflection of windowcleaner.com all I did was purchase the items from windowcleaner.com. As far as using the stuff residentially, I didn't have a bad a bad time with it. I had to, of course, switch out the rubbers. The Mormon rubber is no good. The NXT rubber, I did not care for that. The handle that I bought, I don't know where it's at. It's around here somewhere. I might have thrown that in the lake. It was okay. It's, it's built okay. It's made in China. China. As which most stuff is, I guess. The Dr. Angle arm or whatever it is I couldn't even use it because it won't go on a single pole that I own um, I'm assuming you have to have like a Mormon pole for it to go on there uh, so you're not going to get a review on that I like the accelerator handles I like the flick pad I use a 14 inch to cone channel for my flick pad I don't use a liquidator channel for obvious reasons the newer handle it all that channels all both channels did with either rubber is just slid back and forth in there the older handle it bit but and it didn't move so i don't know what the difference between the two is i'm not sure but i'm kind of a no-nonsense guy it should just work right out of the box i shouldn't have to do a bunch of bullshit to get it to work Again, it didn't the the, the the stuff that I used the, the liquidator channel it didn't perform bad in a residential setting, but as soon as I started using it on commercial glass, I, my frustration level went through the roof. All the, the plastic ends do is dig into the rubber on the gaskets around the windows. So I do not recommend any liquidator channel for commercial work whatsoever. If you want to use it for residential, if you want to use the the liquidator channels in a residential setting, I don't think you, it's not, you're not going to have too terrible of a time, just a little bit of a learning curve. So I can say that if you want to try something that's supposedly supposed to be 
less detailing, then I don't see anything wrong necessarily with buying some liquidator channels if that's if for maybe residential work. I'm just like I said, I'm not a huge fan. If there is a soft gasket anywhere on the window, those plastic ends are digging into it. I mean, maybe you know some dude's probably going to be like, "Oh, it works fine," but it, you know, I don't round over, sand them off. I, I don't know, but it just it, they don't work good with soft gaskets around the window. They just don't. They dig into everything. At least the way that I use them. The way that I clean windows. I mean, and then it, that part of it is what about like I find the strangest about this stuff is it's supposed to get real close and hold the rubber down and be a really exact tight clean and if you try to use them that way they dig into shit so I don't know the only bright spot I'm gonna be honest the only bright spot with the stuff that I bought was the fugu sleeve I really like that sleeve it's a nice sleeve I, everyone knows I'm a handy sleeve guy. I just prefer the handy sleeve, how tight it keeps the stuff on the hand, uh, on the T-bar. So I can't say that I'm going to be using that, but I, I can recommend that. If you're not a handy sleeve guy, that Fugu sleeve from Mormon, I, I like it. It's nice. It's, it's a nice, it's nice and abrasive. It does a really good job of scrubbing stuff off the windows. It stays pretty wet. Um, the T-bar, mm, Again, it's a T-bar. I think a durability will come into question after a while. It seems to be a little, just a little goofy, but that was the strongest thing I'd say after, what I got out of the box, the strongest thing is the Fugu sleeve. Second place would be the, 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 the soap. The soap is okay. But the, the channels, I just, I, the channels are garbage. I can't. Not I I'm I apologize to Mormon for saying that, but they're just they're not they're not good they're not good they're not good. I see the idea I see you know, but it's like version 3.0 and they're still they're just not good. They're not good. You can get a more accurate clean with a regular brass channel and your rubber cut properly. It's just a gimmick. I'm sorry. Those channels are a gimmick to me. I'm, I, and I'm not sorry for saying that. It, they're they're not. The sleeve is nice. I love the accelerator handle. The accelerator handle is awesome. But anyone that you see using an accelerator handle, 99% of them have an, a a channel that's not a liquidator channel. Them because those channels are garbage. They're junk. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Dudes, some dudes may not want to hear that, but they are junk. I'm sorry. Do not, I strongly do not recommend. They're just not good. It pains me to say that. I wanted them to work. I had the first version. I pre-ordered them. I pre-ordered the whole kit. Everything that, that Mormon came out with initially, I pre-ordered every piece of equipment they sold. And I was very disappointed then I bought the 2.0 same thing now I have the 3.0 it just they're not good it's just not a good idea I'm sorry it just isn't you know you see that they have that six inch squeegee out squeegee channel out now with the step down looks just like an Unger, Unger S plus channel go figure imagine that I just again I can't it you're just not it's not good it's not good I wanted this review to go differently, but, and I was going to get, when I left the last job, like the first restaurant I did early this morning, I, I can't even show you guys that shit, how pissed off I was. Um, I don't even know how much, like I ended up throwing one at the last, I ended up throwing the hand, throwing the handle. Shit is fucking trash. At the last job I was at, that's how pissed off I was. Like I'm, the frust, my frustration level is through the roof with this stuff I I've gone all week using the stuff I really really tried and some of these houses are every house I did this week was huge and I used that Mormon stuff the whole time I did not have too terrible of a time residentially with the Mormon stuff I will admit that once you get the angle down and all that stuff 
you got to use an accelerator handle though because not one of those other handles that they sell mormon those handles are no good for their channels you have to use that 40 degree handle you have to or it just it works like shit but as soon as i got it into a commercial setting that i mean boom my, my head popped off i just i can't I've been doing this for a really long time and I feel like I can clean windows with just about everything. I have I have every tool in the box, you know what I mean? And with this stuff, it just, it's not happening. I can clean windows with a brass channel here, zero issues. That liquidator channel, I, it, it, they're, they're, they're trash. I'm sorry, they're trash. I can't, I, they're just not good. I'm not gonna, Get on here and do a YouTube video. Guys asked, hey man, will you do some Mormon stuff? Sure. I'm not going to get on here and lie to people and be like, oh, well, you know, it's not bad. It worked okay residentially. I still had to do a bunch of detailing. So right there, the gimmick is less detailing. I get, less de I get lesser detailing with our uh, Ed Array brass channel that's been out since 19 or 1832. Than I do with this brand new, it's plastic end, it's designed to less detail. I'm sorry, I'm not, no, I'm sorry, no. It did not work that way. But it did work better than it did commercially. I was able to move a lot faster than, I, when I, than using it in a commercial setting. I will admit that. But outside of residential, it's, there, it's no bueno. It is not meant for commercial work whatsoever. Whatsoever. And the dude wants to get in the comments and be like, Oh, I use it on commercial all the time. Then you take all day doing shit then. Sorry. <laughs> but that's my final thoughts on the stuff. I'm not going to go another day. I'm not going to... I went from Saturday to Thursday with the stuff. I'm not going... I'm not working tomorrow and uh, Saturday with the stuff. I want to get on with my life. I cannot be more happy to not be using a tool. Like I am, like that's where my frustration level is at. I am done with this shit. Done. So, the Fugu sleeve gets a thumbs up for me. I like the sleeve. The T-bar is okay. Um, the accelerator handles, love them. Love the flick pad. As long as it's not on a liquidator channel, which is crazy to say. But <laughs> those liquidator channels, they could stop making those tomorrow. And it would be everyone would be better for it. They're just not good. They are not good. But if you want to buy any of that stuff, go to windowcleaner.com. Click through the affiliate link below. And uh try it out the soap was good too i mean it's not terrible soap it's nice soap but i just the channels man it's really what it boils down to is the channels are fucking trash i can't say no more about it than that and if anybody watching this wants the whole lot that i have here the two channels the the a fixed handle the fugu sleeve the t-bar you could PayPal me the shipping and I'll say I'll send it all to you. Lightly used. Well, except for that one I threw. <laughs> I just I'm not a fan of the channels, man. They are just they are a huge fucking disappointment. I'll stick with my S plus stuff. I'll stick with my janitor gear. So yeah, no bueno, man. No bueno. I'm sorry that it turned out this way in the end. And I apologize for everybody to, uh, for my frustration. I'm just totally fucking frustrated with the shit. I, I just cannot... I gotta be honest. I just My frustration level is through the roof with it. So... I hope you guys enjoy this video. What? How? I don't know. Like I said, it, it's it just... I struggled so much with this with those channels this week that... I, I don't even know how much I have on video. That I mean, it's, it's so bad. It's so bad. Like, I have never been this frustrated. I haven't been this, frust this frustrated with cleaning windows since I started cleaning windows. 
I even reached out to Steve and like, hey man, what am I doing wrong? You know, he's like, uh, you know, like what should I, what angle should I be doing this? And you know, him and I had a conversation. I used the thing the way he said, and it did work out better. But the channels, they're just not good. Steve-O doesn't even use liquidator channels in his handle. He uses Ettore channel. I, I don't know what else to say about it than that, guys. It's all you need to know. Look anywhere on the internet. Except for maybe one or two guys are like, Oh, liquidator channels are great. They're not. They're not. <laughs> They're just not. <laughs> I'm sorry, dudes. But... Like and subscribe and all that stuff if you want. Again, I know this is probably not going to be a very popular video, but I can't. I've got to be honest. I have to be honest with people. I just it is. I do not like the tools. I just don't like them. The handle, like, is yeah. I'm not going to keep going over and over it just to try to like make people feel good about shit. It just there. Those are my thoughts. Man, he, he's met him, man. Them was the days, man. Yeah. Just fucking with you, man. Just no school buddy, man. This one right here, man. Look, man. Just listen to what I got here, man. If you ain't feeling it, man. Just gotta get my mold on, man. In my head, man. Yeah, sometimes, man. Man, it's pounding, man. Like my mood, man. It's, man, it's like I can't stop, man. When I'm out here on this track, man, I gotta keep my game tight, man. It's hard out here for a pimp.